Good morning. I look bald head like this, but I promise y'all I got a ponytail back there. I might put it up a little bit more. But good morning. It is the Sunday after vacation. Um, and I am about to clean up. So I did already put my dishes in the sink, me in a dishwasher. I wiped down all my counters. The only thing I have to do now is I have to vacuum my floor and I have to mop. And now I'm gonna start cooking Sunday dinner. So I want to just pick up the camera and film with y'all. Um, just to kind of let y'all see what I do when I'm doing like my Sunday reset, y'all. I had such a good time on vacation. I'm not sure if y'all have seen the Cancun vlog by now. Most likely y'all probably have already seen the Cancun vlog. And y'all, we had so much fun. That was just the perfect vacation that I needed to finish off this year strong. Um, going into December, going into Vlogmas. Y'all, we are going to try to do Vlogmas at least three times a week this month in December or next month in December. So I'm just excited about all things when it comes to content. So I'm about to vacuum the floor really quickly and then I'm gonna talk to y'all in a second. Yeah, so I got this vacuum from Amazon and it is a handheld vacuum. It is obviously pink. Y'all, I love this thing so much. So it will be linked down below if y'all want it. But I will say it works better on hardwood floor. Okay, I be putting like a little pine saw. Where my pine saw at? Oh, this is my little uh, Dollar Tree Family Dollar pine saw. I'm gonna put a little bit of that in there, um, and I'm going to put a little. Oh, I got some real pine saw too, and I'm gonna put a little bit of bleach just to kind of kill off any of these little germs that's going around. Cause y'all know, soon the weather starts to change, the germs definitely start. And then I wanna put a little bit of Spick and Span in there as well. I know a lot of people be like, oh, you shouldn't mix, you shouldn't mix stuff. Well, I do, I always have, always will, unfortunately. So I'm gonna just put a little splash of that. And that was some bleach. I might just use the rest of this pine saw. That go and go in there. A little Spick and Span. Cause I love my house to smell like bleach when I'm done. My house don't smell like that. If it don't, if it don't smell like what I'm using, I ain't clean good enough. Okay. So we're gonna put all this stuff back. 
Because y'all know me. If I take it out, I like to put it right back. And then we're going to start mopping. <laughs> my entire house so we are about to go to my storage unit really quick across the hall and i'm gonna pull out my christmas stuff but i'm not gonna put the christmas tree up in this video um i got a whole plan y'all for the next video so maybe the video after this one that's when my christmas tree will be put up but i'm gonna just kind of get all the stuff out today and then other than that i've been cleaning up everything else like i told y'all i already did my dishes stuff like that i just mopped the floor I might try to organize a few little things and yeah, we'll be done. Honestly, I forgot about some of this stuff. I forgot I made all of these. Okay, so I'm gonna buy, I don't have to buy a new rug. I got my Christmas, Christmas rug. I don't gotta buy that. Honestly, I'm about to have my boyfriend come and bring this out because I'm definitely, oh yeah, oh no, I think, I can't pick up all this stuff. This is St. Patrick's Day. This is Valentine's Day stuff. That's gonna stay. And I made all these last Christmas. Um, all those are handmade by me, of course. Oh y'all, this little piece of hair is gonna irritate me. This is why I do not like wearing my real hair. Okay. This one or this one. This one's okay as well. I don't know what's in this bag, y'all. Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna have him come and get the rest of this stuff. I can't carry it. All of this. Back. 
carry this and I'm gonna see y'all back. So I got my tree. Um, got my tree and then these are some decorations. Like I said, I'm not gonna open it up in this video. That'll be a whole different video by itself, but we did do Grinch last year for our theme. So I'm definitely gonna probably go to the store tomorrow and get some more Grinch themed things. So just stay on task. And then, like I told y'all, these are like the little uh, snowflakes I did. And then we do have inside of here, I got some like pillows and things like that. The Grinch pillow and stuff. So yeah. Well, hey y'all, so I'm about to cook Sunday dinner. So I ended up ordering some greens and macaroni from like this restaurant that's around my house. And y'all, this was like 40, 34 dollars. Like, come on now, please be for real. So I'm gonna make some hamburger steak I'm using some ground beef and I have my salad already together. And I have my eggs boiling and then I have pieces of chicken. I'm gonna just cut up and just put it in the salad. Just have like a little piece of chicken in the salad. So um, I'm gonna let y'all probably watch me do a little bit of work. The hamburger steak can get like a little messy. So I don't wanna keep touching the food and touching my camera. Like that's just nasty. So I might set y'all up, let y'all watch me do a little bit. And then of course I'll come back with the final result later on tonight. Love you and the success hear my words and listen to my signal of distress i grew up in the city and know sometimes we had less compared to some of my niggas down the block man we were blessed and life can't be no fairy tale no once upon a time but i'll be goddamn if a nigga don't be trying so tell me mama please why you be drinking all the time because all the pain he brought you still lingering in your mind because pain still lingers on mine on the road to riches listen this is what you find the good news is nigga you came a long way Bad news is, nigga, you went the wrong way. Being broke is better. Life that's better than yours. No such thing as life that's better than yours. Think being broke is better. Life that's better than yours. No such thing. No such thing. For what's money without happiness? Or hard times without the people you love? Though I'm not sure what's about to happen next. I ask for straight from the Lord of the book. I've been strong so far, but I can feel my grip loosening Quick, do something before you lose it for good Get it back and use it for good And touch the people how you did like before I'm tired of living with demons cause they always inviting more Think being broke was better Now I don't mean that phrase with no disrespect To all my niggas out there living in debt Cash and minimal checks Turn on the TV, see a nigga Rolex And fantasize about a life with no stress I mean it's just sincerely and as a nigga who was once in your shoes, living with nothing to lose, I hope one day you hear me. Always gonna be a bigger house somewhere, but nigga, feel me. Long as the people in that motherfucker love you dearly. Always gonna be a whip that's better than the one you got. Always gonna be some clothes that's fresher than the ones you rock. Always gonna be a bitch that's better out there on the tours. But you ain't never gonna be happy till you love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life Heart beating fast, let a nigga know that he alive. Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass, let a nigga know that he arrived. cooking dinner i'm gonna show y'all everything that i made so i made a salad with a couple of eggs and stuff like that in there and then this is what the meat looks like i promise it looks way better in person 
And then we have some macaroni. Macaroni and greens. Again, they toss us a large. That's not a large, but macaroni and greens. And then we have some rice. And I also have some bread. So this is just like my little Sunday routine that I like to do. I don't cook home cooked meals like this every Sunday, but when I'm in the mood to, I get down. Later that day. Y'all, that food was so good. Like, when I say so good, so good. I really snapped on that food. Like, I put my foot in it today, okay? So, now, I'm in my office. About to do a little work. But, I did have somebody reach out to me on DHG. I'm not a fan of DHG at all. And this is the reason why. Like, I just cannot do a DHG. And if I do a sub promos for DHG, just know that they pay me. A good amount of money and it will never be bags because all my bags are real so i want nobody to get that confused like baby none of my bags are from dhg all my bags are real all my gucci bags louis real but a company reached out to me and it was like hi dear we want to do a promo whatever whatever yada 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 like you know you can choose whatever you want to choose so the first thing i chose was a pair of chanel shoes so a pair of Chanel shoes. So I told them like, hi, I'm interested in the Chanel shoes, size eight. I, I told them a size eight. Um, yeah, I told them a size eight and everything like that. They was like, dear, unfortunately, because you have a low amount of views and like a low amount of followers. I think at that time I had like 20K. He was like, because you got a low amount of views and low amount of followers, like, you know, we can't send you the Chanel shoes. I guess because Chanel shoes are very popular um you know higher price because it's chanel and things like that so i'm like okay cool i was like all right sir and he was like he gave me an, a new list of shoes to choose from mind you if you knew that i'd have like enough followers from the first place why would you even include the chanel shoes on the list but that's beside the point so anyway he like okay here's a new list that you can choose from i said okay sir i can just choose a pair of uggs okay cool so the pair of uggs i chose were supposed to be the long like the like the tall pair of uggs like the like, like the full length uggs right so let me show y'all what they sent me first of all they still sent me the chanel shoes they still sent me the chanel shoes but guess what i can't fit them because they are too small this is what they look like i told my little cousins that if they can fit them they can have them and if they cannot fit them these will be um on my website for black friday so by the time y'all see this video it's going to be the week before black friday so Wait until Black Friday, and if you see it's on the website, then they'll be on the website. But if not, then if not. So, these are the Chanel shoes um, that they still sent me, even though they said that I didn't qualify for them. I'm like, okay, cool, whatever. But I'm still mad because I can't fit them. But it's fine. Like I said, y'all, I'm not really a fan of DHG. But if it comes to down to a promo making some money, I'm going to accept it. Now, this is what I was really looking forward to. Because if y'all know, if y'all live in Chicago, or if y'all live in the Midwest, y'all know that it's about to be wintertime. It's about to be snowing outside. So, a free pair of Uggs, I don't really care about the Uggs now. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody looking back at my label that bad. And honestly, I drive in a car, so nobody's looking back at my shoes. So, I'm like, okay, cool. I'll do the Uggs. I'm thinking that they're going to send me, like, the regular long-length Uggs. If I can include the picture, I'm going to include it right here of what I asked for. This is what they sent me, y'all. Like, what is this? What? What is this, y'all? Like, really? What is this? And then, guess what? I can't fit these either. So, it's given... I don't know what it is. I don't know if my feet just don't work or if their sizing is different because it's DHG overseas. I don't know what it is, but both of the pair of shoes that was sent to me, neither pair fit. And I literally... Y'all see me in a vlog like two weeks ago... I went to go buy a pair of Uggs that's a size 7. And I have Uggs that's size 8. And then on the inside of here, they say these are a size 39. I don't even know what a size 39 is for real. So I'm just like, what am I going to do with these? So again, I told my little cousins. They, they were coming over. Uh-oh, not sassy. Nothing chewed them up already. They are coming over um, in a couple days anyway. And if they can't fit these, these will be on, on the website as well for Black Friday. But it's just crazy 
how both of the pair of shoes I got from DH Gay, neither one of them fit. And honestly, neither one of the shoes is what I agree to. So I'm just like, this is why, like, I cannot do DH Gay. Like, this is why, because you just don't never know what you're going to get. So those are my DH Gay packages. I still got to do videos for them, which I might just go ahead and do the videos now. Honestly, my nail's not done. So I might just wait probably sometime this week and do the videos for both of them. And honestly, I told the person, like I emailed back the man, and I was just like, the shoes that we agreed to was the long, the long Uggs. That is not what we agreed to. So he like, oh dear, I'm sorry. You're going to have to resend another package. So I'm not posting nothing until I get what I asked for or what you came to me for. And now I got to do some Shein stuff. I got all these Shein items to um, try on. I might do it tomorrow. So I'm just not really in the like. Not I ain't in the mood. I'm always in a good mood, but for the most part, but I'm just kind of tired. Cause I did like cook today and I clean today, so I want I want to make sure my energy is like really good for the video. So I might just wait till tomorrow to do these. But I got an idea of like what I want to do. So I want to just kind of put myself like put on each. Jack, because those, those are all cardigans. So, so I'm gonna be like cardigan fans from Shein, and I want to just stay in the same spot, put the first one on, move around, then put the second one on, move around, do the same exact movements, and then edit it so it looks like every time I move, I change my shirt or change my jacket. So I kind of got an idea of how I want to edit that video so I can kind of get some good little views and stuff like that. But other than that, y'all, I'm going to end today's video right here. I know it was like probably a quick little short little one, but I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And as always, make sure you hit that black subscribe button and I will see you later. Bye.